okay, it's just me. Huh? Uh, uh. Ah! Oh. oh my gosh, was this a dream? Oh. Holy crap, guys! Hold on, guys! Oh. Ow, my arm! Ow! Ow! Oh, right! Sorry! Oh, crap, my arm. Okay, guys. I'm here. Calm down. I'm getting you out. Ow, crocky might. Uh, Alright. Finally, I can breathe. Get me out, guys! Ugh. Oh, I can't breathe. Whoa. Xander, what took you so long? Funny story, Adam. I fell asleep. Oh, Crocky Mike. I just feel like something happened, but I just can't remember what exactly. Yeah, Phil was right. I did think something bad happened, but I don't know what either. Xander. Do you know? Uh, I think I know what happened. Guys, you might want to sit down for this. Okay, how do I start this? Okay, so in the beginning of October, I don't know what date or day I'm going to say. So, um,. There's a special event going on, right? Special event. So what that was, um, the government released a giant monster-like creature into my town, and the government said to go outside and film this because this was a special event. And whoever can make the best movie out of that shot wins. And for me, I was participating in it. The only thing I can remember was that I heard a helicopter, I tried to call them all of a sudden, I heard something, looked up, and I saw the monster. And, I my face. and then I passed out. And that's all what happened. Wow. Crocky. What was that? Wait. What did they say today? Goodness gracious, it's Christmas Eve. Wait, you mean we've been in this room for about two months? What was that? Could it be Saint Nick? Nah, it can't be Santa Claus. I don't think you guys might not heard, but Santa, he's fake. There's no proof. Zilla, for once, can you just shut up? Please, it could be either Santa Claus or Berkeley. But what you're doing is making more noises. Well, for me, I think it has to be a burglar because no way Santa does not exist. Wow. Wow. Was this here before, Xander? Well, Adam, to be honest with you, no, because I will remember decorating the Christmas tree or someone else would, but. We were all awake when this happened, so it could be anyone. But who could have done this? I mean, it's not a, a crime or anything. It's kind, but I wonder who could it be? Hmm. Well, guys, in my opinion, I think it must be Santa Claus. Because he knows when you're sleeping, and he knows when you're awake, so... Maybe he might have decorated Christmas tree for us for Christmas! But I think that's a beautiful gift. Hey, Chad, if it's Santa Claus, then where the heck is he, Mike? Ho, ho, ho. Well, my friend, I was just in the kitchen admiring some of those delicious cookies. <gasps> Santa Claus! Hi, hi, did you mean to Mike? I swear, Santa, forgive my friend, but why are you here? I'm here for all four of you. For us? But why? Well, this is a big story. I was on my sled about to deliver presents in this house. What happened was my sled just stopped working. It has. Wait, you're telling me that your sled is not working, but you have those magical reindeers to make you go to different locations to deliver presents. 
So I don't understand. Yeah, Adam's right. I don't understand either. Let me continue, Adam. And yes, I do have magical rain gears on my sled, but let me give you an example. I have two magics in my sled. My sled and the rain gears. But if one of them does not work, I can use it. And since my sled is not working, Christmas will be ruined. That's why I'm asking all four of you to help me out. And you're probably going to need a vehicle. Wait, we need a vehicle to to go deliver our presents, but how are we going to do that, huh? Take a bus or something on Christmas Eve? What? What? Okay, it's just a remote device thing. Whoa! Crocky Mike! He just magically spun a train! Xander, you're the only person that has hands that work, so I highly advise you take this. It, it may it could be a lightsaber to you. Now, this may sound like a dumb question, but does anyone know how to drive a train? At your service.